Welcome back to Franchise TV on this YouTube channel, I'll unbox anything. Today we're unbagging the new Geek Fuel mystery bag. Used to be a box, now it's a bag. And I actually, I figured out how to actually cancel this Geek Fuel. So, I guess my account through Geek Fuel like on the actual website, it no longer exists. When I try to do a password reset, my entire account has been like canceled. So there's no way for me to go in to actually cancel the subscription. I was able to track down that I use my Amazon Pay as like the Amazon Pay processor. So I was able to go into my Amazon Pay account and that's where I can cancel the subscription since Geek Fuel for some reason is like locked me out of my own account on Geek Fuel so I can't end my subscription, which is kind of very, very odd. So if you subscribe to Geek Fuel, understand it might be kind of hard to cancel your subscription. I heard people that are now subscribing to Loot Crate they are having a lot of trouble getting their subscription canceled because you can no longer cancel Loot Crate on their website like how you could for years. You have to call in to them and problem is you can't get through to anybody to cancel your subscription. So from what I've been told, a lot of people just had to end up just doing credit card chargebacks and put refusal on their credit cards for Loot Crate future like um, withdrawals of money. So anyway... I figured out the only way for me to cancel the Geek Fuel is to go into my Amazon Pay account and then cancel any more charges from Geek Fuel on my Amazon Pay account. So, <laughs> kind of a headache, right? I didn't realize I'm paying 27 bucks for literally a t-shirt now through Geek Fuel. That's not a very good deal. When they were just doing like the most recent, just, just the box, you remember? It was like just the box. It was, that box was like what, 20 bucks a month plus shipping? Ended up being like $29. So now they've taken away a few items and literally they're charging the same price. Literally the same price because they're they're paying less in shipping. So yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna end up I'm canceling Geek Fuel because I, I told you everybody I'd give it a few months to see what their new mystery bag is like. And yeah, I'm not impressed with it. It's it's not worth the money. So here we go. Literally there's like three things in here usually. T-shirt, pretty much you're paying like 27 bucks for just a freaking T-shirt. There's the T-shirt. And okay, it is kind of like uh, in inspired by Jurassic Park. Okay. The new Jurassic Park movie starts, I think uh, was it last week? By the time I upload this video, it hasn't actually started yet. It starts this Friday. But by the time I upload this video and publish it, it'll be like the prior week it started. But Jurassic Park inspired T-shirt. And then you get another one of these $5 Geek Fuel like website cards, but you have to buy something on their website just to get your $5. Then you have a Jurassic Park trading card, and then a, a pin of Wizard of Oz Ruby Slippers. So 27 bucks, that's all they give you. Of course, that's $27 with shipping. <laughs> Pretty weak. They're giving this shirt a $25 value. I'm canceling the Geek Fuel subscription. It's it's not a good subscription service anymore. Pretty much you're paying for a t-shirt that usually aren't that great. So this will probably be the last Geek Fuel you see, unless if for some reason they're able to push through my Amazon Pay withdrawal. But this should be the last Geek Fuel. This should be it. It should be done. So word of advice, it was kind of a hassle to figure out how to cancel the subscription, but I figured it out. I'm locked out of my account on their website. It doesn't exist anymore. They deleted it. So I have to go through my Amazon Pay, which is what I authorized to pay for this. Go through Amazon Pay to cancel the or cancel any future payments. First-hand experience. That's just my experience. So not worth the money. I'm canceling. I gave it a few months of the new Geek Fuel mystery bag, and it's not good. Not for what they're charging. It's no good. So this is it. The last Geek Fuel.